Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Good morning, Jennifer Jolly. Thank you for joining me on my favorite day called Friday. How are you? TGIF. I am doing so well. It's tough to not have a great day when you're in the middle of the Caribbean on a cruise ship. Oh, vicariously, take us where you are. Today you know my guest is Jennifer Jolly, and we're going to take a cruise. So you guys come along with Jennifer and I. Jennifer, what's going on in your beautiful world? Well, just imagine you are on board a luxurious cruise ship. It is beautiful, sunny blue skies, just a few puffy white clouds, a slight breeze, and you're getting to travel just like you did when you were a child. Remember when you traveled, you'd go on vacation as a kid and you didn't have to worry about anything. You didn't have to worry about keys or tickets or arrangements or anything except how much fun you were going to have that day. Well, the it was latest, magical. Uh, right? Well, the latest travel technology makes that possible again, even for us grown-ups. So, so what uh, hopefully I've set the scene here. Okay, you have. So mm -hmm. give us the future of all, uh, which is today, of all this technology. Well, meet the little wearable, or let me introduce you, I, I can say for radio uh, listeners here, let me introduce you to the wearable that could change the way we all travel. It's called the Ocean Medallion, and over the past week, some 10,000 people, including me, have been able to use it on board one of the three newly teched out Carnival Corporation's Princess Cruises ships. Now, the little gadget is able to replace keys, cards, wallets, money, passports, but most of all, hassle. It helps the crew find you and know you before you even say hi to them or even have to tell them your name. They know exactly who you are, what you need, when and where you need it. It also helps you find your way around these large ships, even track down your travel mates. And talk about large, when you're on a ship that's almost four city blocks long and about 10 stories high, <laughs> that alone wow. comes in handy several times a day. Oh, wow. Okay. They're getting all this information, but can I control how they use it? Well, you know what's amazing is they don't actually store any of your private or personal information on the medallion itself. There's no information on the actual gadget. So the way that it works is uh, it stores kind of something like a license plate. It's except if the license plate number um, was non-meaningful. It's like an encrypted number that meets or exceeds the security levels that banks use. So the entire medallion ecosystem also uses dual factor authentication, including your security picture at all transaction points. But again, all of your sensitive data and guest information, all, all of that is encrypted and anonymous. So it, unlike key cards, unlike those travel cards you used to have to have on cruise ships, and could never keep up with. Right, right. And would <laughs> lose or would, or would accidentally go swimming with. These are also waterproof, weatherproof. So all, it's actually added several new layers of security for your personal and private information. I know we're going to be seeing that on land uh, uh, businesses because that's a great idea. It really is a great idea, and some other travel companies, some other cruise lines, uh, of course, you know, Apple Pay, there's ways to pay with your phone, but what I like about this, and that, and that data, your credit card data is actually living on your phone, your smartphone. What I like about this is it can be as technologically savvy or untechnologically savvy as possible. I mean, there's no on-off button. It just works in the background. You don't have to charge it. You don't have to worry about it. All you have to do is slip it into a bracelet or on a clip or on a necklace and remember to put it in your pocket or, or just wear it anytime you're on that ship or even off that ship. It even helps you to get right on board. There's no lines getting on or off the ship anymore. I mean, it just take something, one of the biggest headaches of travel, like even waiting in long lines and just immediately does away with it. So yeah, absolutely, I think we'll see it in other industries. I mean, certainly the airlines could use it, but then beyond that, think like hospitals, universities, and of course for shopping. <laughs> Got to put shopping in <laughs> Of course. In there. Yeah. <laughs> Jennifer, you're always in the middle of cutting edge. The last time, you know, you were at the launch of some what was that, the Oprah Cruise thing, I think? Yes, most likely, you know, yeah. 
Right. You're always at the, the, the cutting edge of information for, for my audiences and audiences around uh, the world. Is it because you're an Emmy Award winning journalist? <laughs> this is what helped you to do this? Yes, that is exactly right. This is my job. This is my life. I've been doing it uh, since before smartphones were even a thing. In fact, I started in the industry about the time the internet came out and uh, about the time cell phones became available for the, the mere mortals. So yeah, I've been doing this forever. And, and I didn't start out being really super tech savvy. And I think that that's been really good. I didn't grow up with technology. I've had to learn it the same as everyone else. And so I'm able to really take a look at things and see, you know, as a journalist, what they mean in the world around us, but then also as just someone who would like all these gadgets and this tech to actually make our lives a little better, a little easier. I can see what's able to do that and, and what's uh, of maybe tech for tech's sake, but not all that useful. Well, you do a great job. Let me ask you, where can my audience get more information? Because I know they want to know more about the medallion. Yes, and how you might be seeing this pop up across your other travels as well. Go to princess.com, and then I'll be doing a full story and posting that any minute now at techish.com. All right, you guys head on over there. Don't call me. Go over where <laughs> Jennifer sent you and get more information. Jennifer Jolly, have a great weekend. Try not to have too much fun on the cruise, but vicariously, we love you. Thank you. Oh, right back at you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB Show, broadcast on radio and television. And this is My Phone Pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.